Hi guys and welcome back. Hello if you're new, my name is Sarah and I make lots of fun decor videos like this. I also make lots of other mommy and lifestyle content and as well as clean with me's and what's for dinner videos. If you like that, I would love it if you hit that subscribe button. But today's video is a very exciting one. It is a winter wonderland um, decor room for my girls. So my oldest daughter is about to turn five and her biggest thing that she wanted this year was a shelf. And as you can see, my brother was installing that for me um, but every year I try to decorate their rooms and just kind of add to um, the magic of Christmas I love Christmas so much and it was so magical for me as a little girl and I want to create that same magical um, feeling for my little girls and so I have been decorating their rooms um, these past two years and this year we went all out and added even more decorations um, as you can see I just took this bedding now this was just washed I just washed it um, but this I turned it over to the red side because I wanted everything to be mostly red and I was going for a very fun like vintage almost 1960s vibe um, and I'm using these pillows Target totally I've been looking for pillows for so long and Target totally hit the nail on the head with the pillows this year they were exactly what I was looking for so I was so excited um, these are in the Target dollar spot they were five dollars each and I got two sets so I got the stockings one and the Christmas tree ones and then for each um, of my daughters I just switched them so they had different patterns for both of them so my oldest got the stockings one with the polka dot on the back, and then my youngest I switched to the Christmas tree one. Um, I then took this tinsel that I got from Hobby Lobby. It was $11.99, but um, half off, I believe. And it is so beautiful and full. I love it. I cut it in half, and then I just put it at the edge of their beds. I decided to put it at their edge of the beds because I didn't want them to constantly be hitting it with their heads in the middle of the night or anything. And I just thought it added a little extra pizzazz and fun. Um, and I really liked how it turned out. I'm glad I put it there. Like I said, Olive really wanted a shelf. That was her main Christmas wish this year. So we got her a shelf and I got all of these fun um, ornaments from Hobby Lobby. Now basically all I did is take um, command hooks and I just put them upside down on the shelf. So um, it's a little scary because the string's so thin that I feel like I was nervous for them just to fall right off. So what I did is I took a piece of regular like scotch clear tape and just um, wrapped it around the edge of the command hook so they could dangle freely there and look really cute. But at the same time, they, I wasn't worried about the um, string sliding off and fall, um, having them fall. Um, that tape kind of kept them in place. So it worked out really well and I loved how it turned out. It looks so fun and cute. Um, and then I found these years also at Hobby Lobby these were hard to come by they were like gone within like the beginning of September or maybe even August so I actually think got them in August so I'm really glad I didn't buy them early because I did not see them after that um, and I just think they're so cute and whimsical once again they fit into that vintage vibe but the colors are a little bit more modern and they're so perfect for the girls room I just think they're adorable and um, I think that they added just like a fun vintage look to it I then took this Christmas tree that I found at the Target Dollar Spot this year for $3 and I just think it was fun. Polka dots was perfect and matched with the little pillow and it added some greenery to their room. And then um, I added this pom-pom garland that I got from Hobby Lobby last year but they still have it this year. And I used it last year around the girls like I think bed or something um, and this year I ended up just putting it on the dollhouse to add just a little extra fun for her Barbies. So um, all of the Barbies have a little decoration on their home now too but um, I love that garland I think it's really cute I then got these bottle brush trees which you can find just about anywhere but these were from last year at the Target dollar spot um, and then I just put them around their, their sound machine just to add a little something fun on their um, nightstand I got this little tree at Target last year along with the lights and the ornaments, but of course you can find these trees in just about anywhere and the girls fall asleep to the twinkling lights at night and I just love it. Um, but I wanted to say that the their room was kind of modeled after Eloise at the Plaza. I just loved like the cute little... Um, just the illustrations and the colors of that book I love and so a lot of their decorations worked really well with the stuff that they already had like those um, 
little canopies are from Amazon and the beds, the iron beds are from Ikea and the sheets are from Amazon. And so if you guys have any questions, those are for, they were already pre-existing. Um, but I will try to link all of the bedding and stuff below if I can still find it and get my hands on it. Um, I will try to link everything below for you guys. Next, I found this little sign from the Target Dollar Spot. It says, Welcome to our Winter Wonderland. And I thought it was perfect for their room. And then I found this little ornament that's actually... It's an ornament, but I put it as a door hanger for $3 in the regular Christmas section. And Ollie believes that it was her little elf glitter that helped us out and helped decorate. And so she comes home every year the past couple years. Her room has just been magically decorated while she's at school. And glitter is to thank for that. And so I had that sign that says glitter was here and um her room is just all fun and whimsical and special and magical and it is so much fun to see her face get so excited every time she comes home and sees it um it's just adds so much and for those of you who've been watching my channel recently my dad passed away and so it's been such a hard time for her and she's been grieving so intensely so having something that brings magic and hope back has been so helpful for her and for all of us and I'm just so thankful this year that I went all out like I planned um, and it came out beautifully um, I hope you guys got some ideas from this everything was really relatively inexpensive and it was really easy and it really created such a beautiful fun like vintage style look um, and I loved it um, so like I said that uh, little canopy is from Amazon. It was pretty inexpensive, but I took some lights from Target and just put them inside so they had a little bit of something to uh, add to their bed. And um, I wish they twinkled. They didn't twinkle. I thought they twinkled when I got them, but they're still really cute. And so they fall asleep with the tree twinkling and the little lights in their canopy, and it's just perfect and Christmassy, and I love it. So this is my youngest daughter's bed. Like I said, I flipped the pillows. You can see she has the tree with the plaid, and she she loves the tree. That was the one that she wanted, so it worked out perfectly. But that's the end of this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you got inspired and are looking forward to the new winter holiday season. Um, I'm so thankful for each and every one of you, and um, as this holiday season approaches, I hope that you have hope and joy filling your heart and know that you're loved and um, appreciated and just I hope you feel love. I hope you feel loved and light and I love you and I'm so thankful for all of you and how kind you are to me. So thank you so much for watching. Um, like I said, I will leave everything below that I can find and if you haven't already, I would love it if you followed me here on Instagram at Sarah England and stay tuned for the whole rest of our home to be um, decorated. Uh, we just filmed it yesterday so it should be up next week and it turned out beautifully and I can't wait to show you guys that as well. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.